Well, hello there. This is the Rev. I would like to set a few things clear for those who seem to misunderstand me. I'm not your normal Rev. Oh, legally, I was ordained over 30 years ago. Legally. By man. Then again, anybody that gets ordained or gets priesthood or gets ministry or gets whatever, it's, it's always by man, isn't it? I don't ever see the hand of God coming down, touching a priest on the head and say, you are now ordained a priest. So we can throw that shit, that rule book, out into the toilet. Just think about it for a moment. You believers in Christianity, Catholicism, and I got to bring into this, which I don't know much about, but the Quran, because I've been told it's the third book of the Bible. The Old Testament, the New Testament, and the Quran. Either way, they're all full of shit. That's my personal opinion. Because I think man doesn't ordain man. God ordains man and when I say God I speak of a higher power something that makes God look like a little child playing in the dirt I really don't have any problem with what people believe it's just that I really got a thing about sheeple. People who just blindly follow whatever makes them feel good. Whatever floats their boat. They don't use their own minds. They don't think. Whatever they're comfortable in. These are the people that I wish would open their minds, open their eyes, open their hearts, their souls. I could pull out the Bible. I could pull out a copy of the Quran. I could read to you things that would spin your mind if I told you, oh gee, what if you look at it this way? What if you look at it that way? It's not going to change anybody's mind. And I'm not out to convert anybody. I could give a rat's ass if you want to go to your death believing what you want to believe. The only thing I've ever tried to do in this life is to help people. Not only physically help them, but psychologically help them, to mentally help them, to try to tell them to open their eyes to what's around them. Reality. What it is, is what it is. Oops, smoke died out. Need a lighter. Excuse me for a moment. While I take my time, my video, my time. You don't want to watch it? Shut it off. Go back to eating your peanuts and watching Married with Children. Or should I say, go eat your bonbons and watch Married with Children? Either way, it's a joke. 
you know, most of my comments I make and most of my posts I make aren't to attack people. It isn't to condemn somebody else's belief or religion. It's just to shake your ass up a little, make you open your goddamn fucking eyes and see reality for what it is. I believe in a higher power. I don't call it God. Sometimes I do. But I can call it whatever I want to call it because it's not based on what the name is. It's based on the feeling I have. And it's guided me this far and it's helped me to help a lot of people along the way. And just because you don't like my idea, you'll condemn me. Oh, and it's happened so many times. Especially on Facebook. When I put up my opinion of God this and God that and God sucks, then what happens? Oh, I get hit by the Catholics. Hit by the Christians. Hell, the only people that ain't hit me yet is the atheists. You notice that I'm smoking a cigarette and I'm drinking a beer, but yet I'm calling myself the Rev. I want all you Catholics and you Christians to look deep back in your mind and tell me you don't remember your priest smoking a cigar and drinking a glass of wine. Because if you don't, then somebody hid you from something. Because my mother was a devout Catholic. Not a Christian, a Catholic. And there is a difference. And if you don't know the difference between a Christian and a Catholic, then maybe you ought to pick up Webster's Pocket Dictionary and Thesaurus. My mother was a devout Catholic, but she never never ever made me try to believe in anything whatsoever and I think that was what you would call God's will I call it the higher power anyway I have one last thing to say before I shut my mouth and I'm sure you'll be all very happy. Feel free to leave your comments after this video and I'm sure I'll get back to you. And you know what? There ain't no heaven. There ain't no hell. There just is. And may your higher power go with you. And I am out of here.